Hello, good day. So today, I am going to demonstrate how to position your client in a lateral position. When we say lateral position, it should be positioned either side, either side, either right or left side. So first, we need to knock on the door. Hello, Sir JC. Good day. I am Alexa May C. Zabwa, and I am going to be your caregiver for today. How are you? Sir, I am going to position you in your in the lateral position. The doctor had instructed me to move you or position you into your right side. Is that okay with you? Okay. So first, as standard operate as a standard or SOP, we need to wash our hands using water and a hand soap. After that, you can actually put some alcohol into your hands. So after which, we need to prepare all the necessary things that we need. So first, we have the under pads. You can put it on top of your bedside table. And you need to prepare also your pillows. I need three pillows. And then for example, if the client have a visitor, then you need to excuse yourself. Ma'am, good afternoon. Is it okay that um, I am going to let you wait first outside because I am going to position my client in his right side so that the client can also be um, comfortable in doing such procedure. And after which, for example, um, the client is in the ward and there are a lot of patients, so you need to close the curtains. Close the curtains and then you can now start um, the procedure. So I will go to close the door since we are in a room. Then you need to um, explain the procedure to your client so that he or she can also help you in doing so. Hi sir, good, up. good day. And then you need to put under his toes or feet the blanket. So again, the doctor had instructed to position the client in his right side. So when you are going to position the client, you need to move the client first in the left side. Hi sir, I am going in a count of three. I am going to um, put my my hands under your your shoulders and the other is in your torso. Okay, sir? And then I am going um, to move you in the left side. Okay, sir? One, two, three. And I am going, in a count of three, I am going to move you. One, two, three. And then after which, we are going to move the client's lower part. So our right hand should be on the under the legs of the client and the other hand should be under his back. Sir, in a count of three, I am going to move you in the left side position. Okay, sir. One, two, three. And then you need also to make sure that the client is comfortable. And then you need to ask him, 
Sir, is that is the is the pillow okay? Can you breathe? Okay. Then since you will be moving the client on the right side position, then sir, I am going to um, raise your left side of your legs, okay, sir? And wow, you're doing good. And by the way, guys, I just forgot. Before doing so, before everything else, before um, starting the procedure, I just forgot that you need to make sure that he is the right client, that the client that you will attend to. So I have put a raised band in her in his right hand so that we can identify that he's the right person. So there you're going to um read the name and also his birth name. And then sir, can you position your hands like you're hugging a person? Okay, very good. And then in a count of three, I am go going to move you on your right on your right side, okay? One, two, three. Very good. And then, that is the time where you are going to use your pillows. You can actually fold this. And sir, you can now lay slightly on your back to avoid um, bed sores. You need to protect the joints of your client. I am going to raise your legs so that you will be comfortable in laying down. Not just that, you're going to move your your pillow, your head, and then you can put your right hand on the other pillow. Is that okay with you, sir? Or you can move like that. Don't worry. I'm going to fix that for you. Okay. Is that okay with you, sir? And then, I am going to fix this blanket. Thank you very much and have a nice day.